Yes, Lord, what up, Angels the Saints? It's your boy with the bandana color Salvation Gaming back with another ROR rewrite or recreate video for UFC 3. In this bout, we got a light heavyweight main event with John Jones going up against Alexander Gustus from UFC 165. Took place September 21st, 2013. And in that bout, John Jones came out with the decision win in round five. And is it possible Alexander could change history by defeating John Jones? Or will John Jones recreate history? Who knows? Sit back, relax, grab a snack, and chill like a Mac. Enjoy. The longtime Jackson Wink MMA staple. Here is the Albuquerque, New Mexico based former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones. Essentially an undefeated fighter, the only loss in his career by DQ to Matt Hamill back in the day. He has taken all comers, he has chewed them up, he has spit them out. The consensus greatest mixed martial artist of all time, Johnny Bones Jones. John Jones has been incredibly successful against some of the very best fighters on the planet Earth. He is an immense talent. Tail of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Jones is 30. Gustafson is 31. He is one inch taller. Jones will have a five inch reach advantage. Here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Lovin. The moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! in the UFC Light Heavyweight Division. Introducing host, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, and his professional record of 18 wins, 5 losses. He stands 6 feet 5 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Stockholm, Sweden, Alexander the Mollard And now, if you see the opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a let see new fighter, only a professional record of 23 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Running out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones Okay, Kotecki Seth at all time will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go Ready? down right Fight. now. And we are under that. With 10 career wins by knockout to his credit, here is the baller Alexander Gustafson. As talented a striker as we have in this light heavyweight division, he's finished eight fights in the first round, so a very dangerous guy in the early going. We'll see how he starts this one time. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Jones. Edge of your seat action as expected so far. Tags him.
landed that left hook. Try to establish that jab. So his opponent lands that kick to the body, Joe, and he has shown an increased susceptibility to that strike here tonight. Push kick there to the body. Effective punch there by Johnny Bone. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Oh, Superman punch is good. John looking for the takedown. That one hurt. Oh, effective strike there by Gustafson. Good job timing this combination of strikes here. Gustafson gets caught by the inside leg. First takedown attempt is there. Oh, strong punch there by Jones. He postures into place. Back to full guard. Very nice. He's going to transition to the back. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Excellent movement here on the ground. Now, hammer fist here by Jones. And he connects there. Midway through round one. Change there. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, nice punch there by Gustafson. Beautiful kick there. Takedown landed now by Alexander Gustafson. That north south choke's a very technical choke, and a lot of guys do it wrong. Nicely done. Now he's in full mount. Yeah, that did hurt. You saw the wince. He's got full. Oh, nope, half guard. Nice reversal here into half guard. Oh, useful, well placed kick there. Well, he absorbs a kick to the head here, left it wide open. He's got to not move into that power shot. Let's see if he can adjust. Nice punch by Alexander Gustafson. Boy, Ty Plum now, Joe. Now he's got the double underhooks. Gustafson's pummeling, works in that underhook. And now he's got the tie clinch. Landed that one. Now he's got over on Jones gets double underhooks here in the clinch. Normally now he'll try to change levels and go for a takedown. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. In half guard now. Gustafson gets back up again. Oh, nice. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Absolutely. Whoa! This could be it! Big shot! Oh! Huge shot there, lands flush! Hurt him with the right hand. Huge right hand. And here's a nice kick to the body that lands. And here's another kick to the body. And here's one more perfectly placed kick to the body. 
Amazing highlights from that round. Brittany Palmer with us tonight. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Oh, nice. John Jones with another vicious leg kick. There it is. Transitions to full guard. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Oh, ground and pound elbow to the head. Nicely done to posture up and then land with full power. Now he's back into full guard. Attempting a choke now. And he's out of the guillotine. Jones gets up and decides to take this fight back to its feet, despite having a seemingly dominant position on the ground. Oh, buckled in there. Beautiful shot to the body. Punch coming, it's blocked. Trademark inside leg kick there by Gustafson. Good shot. He avoids the clinch. There's the jab. There's another one. So the double jab is there by Johnny Bone. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Straight right hand now just misses. Gustafson gets the takedown. Now let's see if he chooses to pass here, Joe. Elbow lands for him. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw off that. Stay busy here. You'd like to see that, Joe. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Under three minutes now to go in round two. Full guard. Gustafson's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. They're inside control. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Right back in the full guard. Oh, you don't want to be anywhere near his guillotine choke. Might have the neck here. He popped out of the guillotine. Big punch from the bottom. Both fighters get up now. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Look at this. Just a slip there. Nice punch by Gustafson. Oh, and he connects there. Gustafson gets caught by the inside leg kick a few more. Now he'll leave him up. Oh, he's got him down. Good shot to the head. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Full mount. And a hammer fist. Man, it doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Back up to his feet again. Tries the Superman punch, falls short. More. Absolutely brutal leg kicks from Jones. Really missed with that right hand. Lands a punch there, Joe. Gustafson gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Eats a, a nice right hand. Oh, pretty good entry here on the double leg takedown. No good. Oh! This could be it right here. He's in big, big trouble. That hook. 
20 seconds now remain in the round. 15 seconds remain in the round. Oh, nice hook by Jones. And just misses with that big right hand. Tagged him. And that's the end of round number two. And here we see some beautiful submission offense here. Let's go to a different angle. And here's a huge, perfectly placed punch that lands with devastating impact. Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste. continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Staying busy. He's moved back into side control. And now he is in side control. They clinch up. Gustafson gets up. He is back on the feet. Looked like he was in a submission. Oh, 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 no. He's stunned. He's got him right here. He misses. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Oh, Jones gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Just missed with the left there. Well, Gustafson's got the over under now. Jones gets double under hooks. Not good for the opposition here. There he goes, moves to his back. He pummels under, and now he's got double under hooks. Oh, he's out. He is rocked. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. There and reset. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Gustafson gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. opponent's range, got to find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Pretty good shot there. He's got full guard. He's got the choke. Beautiful job. He's going to try to take the back, I think. He's 
back up to his feet. Oh! Nice jab. Oh, man, that cut is nasty. He's looking to land the right just out of range. How about that chin? Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Counters with a big right punch. 30 seconds to go. Oh, nice jab there by Gustafson. That's a strong position for him up here against the cage. Gets up again here, but hurting. Here's a big punch that results in a knockdown. Let's look at that from a different angle. And let's see if we can get a better look at it from a different angle. Ariane Celeste with us tonight. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've got oh, him. That hurt him. Oh! Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes, and a good sign. Oh! He's trying to hang on. He's looking for a guillotine choke. He's in full guard. And he's out. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Now the hammer fist here by Jones. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Alexander Gustafson. Nice right hand. Jones's cut is only getting worse here, Joe. Man, is that thing bleeding. He's got the clinch. Back to his feet. Big shot from the bottom. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Gustafson. Mounts again. Hip escape, nice hip escape. Excellent sweep. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's in half guard here. Gates up to his feet. Very nice. There it is. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Jones. And look at that, he's up. Switching stances here. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Constantly a moving target. Jones has worked in that arm. Nice job of pummeling, and he's got the double underhooks now. Big knee to the head lands. Oh, 
spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Well, he gets up again here, but he looks hurt. Caught him with a punch. How about that chin? Oh, oh. Wow. He threw an incredibly large volume of strikes, but this last one was the big one that landed for the knockout. Yeah, Joe, a pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming, and before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Check it out again. Boom! Perfectly placed uppercut. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 22 seconds of round number 4. Declaring the winner by Knockout Jones! Looks like history was recreated by John Jones. He took the win by TKO in the fourth round. They went the distance as well. If you want part 2, then like, comment, subscribe, share. Check out some more of my all R U F C three fights. Check out some more of my rewrite or recreate for Fight Night Champion. I'm about to finish up Fight Night Champion Champion mode with your story mode. So stay tuned for that. Um, peace and blessings. Hopefully this video made you smile, made you laugh, lift up your spirits, keep your mind on God and God on your mind with your hand on the Bible and head to the sky. I love y'all.